Yo, what's up guys? Big Yoke here with another Street Fighter 6 video. Today I'm going to show you some tips against Rashid, um, some punishes, some fake stuff like pressure wise, real quick. Um, if you're going to Evo, it'll help you at Evo, I'm sure. And just in general on ranked and online play. Okay, so first I want to talk about his Eagle Spike. Um, don't let Rashid's get away with this in neutral, just like throwing it out there. So all the regular versions and the EX version of Eagle Spike are all negative 36 on block. I'll show you now. 36, 36. So there's a lot of options, especially with Ken that you can do. I'm sure with your character, you can find a lot of options. You could drive rush this and get a full punish that way. Ken, you could actually level two, but you could also do Dragon Lash Kick. Just to let you know, just to show you, I don't have anything on counter wise. So you have plenty of time to do. That was a medium Dragon Lash Kick, Lance Kick, whatever. Um, and you get a full punish counter, which is super good. Not only that, you could also do Ken's run Tatsu combo. Super sick. And then you get two DPs there, I kinda messed up, but you get the idea. Um, so you got Dragon Lance, you got Run Tatsu, you have Drive Rush, full combo. You could also dash up and hit a medium button. So you could do something like that, get corner carry, so on and so forth. There's a lot of options for this. You can perfect parry it. There you go, perfect parry. Corner combo, get some pressure there. Also, you could drive impact it. Big combo there as well, and you burn their drive meter. So that's a really good option. Like, say Rashid's got one bar left, and they do that, or they drop their combo and do that, you drive impact, boom, burn out, and then they're just, it's over. You win the round pretty much if you play it right. So, a lot of options for that move. Don't let them get away. But there is a trick, though, that Rashid can do. So, whenever Rashid does his fully charged fireball, like this, sorry, like this. It actually enhances all his moves afterwards. That's that uh, tornado that's left beside him enhances all of his special moves to make him a little bit more safe and uh, better. So if he does that with Eagle Spike, he's negative 24 on block. Actually, you got negative 24, so it's gonna be a little harder to punish due to the distance and like. He recovered pretty fast. See? Maybe they're closer. No. Nope. He's pretty much safe on that. I haven't found really an option to beat that. Um, he's pretty safe, but you can drive rush and get some pressure in on him because uh, you'd be plus. So that's an option. You could always try to. Uh, perfect period. Also, you could also EXDP if you know it's coming. Usually what Rashid's like to do, and we'll go ahead and go into the next thing I was going to show y'all, is Rashid's like to charge his fireball like on a knockdown setup. And then once they hit you with a fireball, they can just do their spiral move and they're plus two on block. So then they can do light punch or whatever, medium. I don't know how it works. I think medium will trade. But, uh, they do that, they get more pressure. So what you do in this, so say they get a big knockdown, knockdown on you and they do the charge fireball, just wake up and EXDP. Don't don't let them get this for free. They do end up hitting you with this, and they do this, just drive reversal it. If you drive reversal it, pushes them away. Yeah, it's not as good. I mean, it's good, but it's not as good as punishing it. But you see, you get pretty good distance away. You get the reset neutral. 
So it's pretty good. Better than being in a box train. I was gonna show you a couple more things. Just be aware of this move right here and just this move regular. So this move is negative, negative three on block without the enhancement. So if they ever do this, it's your turn afterwards. Now be be wary because some cheese will do the EX after. But if you if you notice them doing the EX after, just keep that as a mental note and um, just be aware of it. But if they do that every time, then just just start punishing them for it because you get a full punish. But uh, if they don't do that, you get your turn back after this. Also, this move is negative three as well, so take your turn on that. Yeah, those are just a couple of tips. Stuff I found, punishes. Um, I think it will help a lot of people. Especially the Eagle Spike. If they start getting away with that, I mean, it can be really hard to deal with if you don't know how to. But it's super negative and um, super punishable unless it's enhanced. But even then, you get pressure, so... Don't let him get away with all this stuff. And besides that, I got one more thing. I'll be hit, heading to Evo this year. I'm super excited. My first time at Evo. It's gonna be like the biggest Evo in a long time or ever, or something like that. So I'm pretty excited. I got a couple buddies that are going as well, and uh, we'll have a good time. So if I don't upload for a while, I'll be there about a week in Vegas. So it's gonna really be pretty fun. If, uh, if you're there. Not can look up for me, but <laughs> you probably you probably won't find me. But it's all good. If you do go, I hope uh, best of luck to you. Whatever game you're playing, and have a lot of fun. So that's it for this video. I uh, appreciate everybody's views, comments, likes, and everything. The past uh, or all my videos on Street Fighter Six, I really appreciate it. all the subs. We need one more sub for 100 subs. Let's go. It's pretty exciting. So y'all have a great day. Appreciate you watching.